Hey everyone, Wolfie here, and welcome to a new series, <coughs> vlog series that I feel like doing because I don't know, I find it, I find it interesting. But welcome to a reading series, the reading series, and this is a ser the first episode of Mini that is a series dedicated to basically just reading some dumb things or awesome things, depending what it is, depending on what I feel like that day. Today. We are reading something that should make your brain cells start committing suicide. Dumb tweets. Or dumb tweets. However, I will say this. I'm not getting these from Twitter. These were grabbed from Twitter, yes. But I'm not grabbing them. I am getting these from a website called dumbesttweets.com. I will put a link in the description for you to go look at them. I'm not taking credit for finding these. I'm telling you, they found them. I'm just reading them to you and making you aware that there are some really dumb people. And for anonymity's sake, I'm not going to put them up. I want to keep these people because they'll know who they are. <laughs> maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. There are some dumb people. Okay. So the first one, and this is top... I think it's top 25 dumbest tweets of 2014. I know that was last year, but this year isn't over yet. So, dumbest tweets ever by dumbtweets.com. I'm not really sure how to describe this. That's the sad part. But it says th this Nia sit his mediocre ass down. 100. Cry, 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 cry. Really cry. I really don't know what to say to this. <laughs> All right, you know what? I I I'm doing it. I have to, cause I just me saying it does not give this thing credit of what it says. This is literally what it says. And as you can see, I, in the comment that the people made of dumb tweet dumbesttweets.com, it's for some reason the mediocre does bring ideas of really thick, like, buff lumberjacks. I, I can't blame him there. Alright, so, let me hide that real quick. <laughs> Alright, so, I can't get this one to fit correctly. But, I thank God for my mature Demeter. Childish people are very embarrassing. <laughs> I slipped into the wrong accent there. <laughs> okay, so there are a couple problems with this. However, there's also a couple good things with this as well. Because I, I can just poke so many holes in this one. First, he means demeanor and embarrassing. He can't spell. This is a he. I'll just assume all of them are he's. But that's the first problem. Is he misspelled something. But then the second part comes up of maybe he didn't mean that in that way. Maybe he was think thinking more, I think I thank God for my mature Demeter. As in Demeter is the goddess of the harvest, which means that this guy could be a farmer person who loves Greek mythology and when he says God he means Zeus and Zeus, I believe, if I can't remember, he's the brother, I believe, of her. Dang, it's been a while since I've done Greek mythology. But, like, he kind of keeps them all mature and not childish, because childish people, a childish, um, childish, uh, Demeter would be horrible because she'd be playing pranks on you, you never know when you get a harvest. So, that was kind of intelligent at the same time. I'm not sure. I don't get this one. <laughs> okay, um, this one says, on my way to London, this should be exciting. I won't miss the lights on the Eiffel Tower. This, and then a picture that I can't see. Because these are snapshots of the thing. So, how? 
uh, okay, I mean, it's stupid if you're coming from America or Russia or anywhere but not south of Paris and you go to the day. That one, I don't... That Some of these, I will not always... I will not read all of these. Simply, you know... I This one hurts my eyes to read. <laughs> I'm gonna give bitches men to shine. Then I tell them good writings. What? <laughs> good writings? Or, no, riddens. Riddens. I can't even say this. <laughs> then I tell them good riddens. How do you comment to this? How? Uh, <laughs> uh, I can't even comment. These are so bad. I, I, I'm not joking. I will try to make this... Uh, I'll be right back. Alright, so I changed my layout. I'm now on the right, and now the things are on the left, and in my editing, I will, I'm going to block out the names and pictures and such, so that's not a problem. But I'm not kidding. That, that. Alright, next one. a math failure. <laughs> I, I, I think I kind of, you know, sat here. I, I probably will leave that in. Me just sitting here staring at this, just like, what? <laughs> I think Miss Sasha Bell, I don't know who these, these, um, ads are. I'm leaving that in. But I don't know who those are. Those very well might be, uh, someone, I don't know. Who's Miss America? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, you were born in 18, 1986. I was born in 1990. I'm 24. You can't be 28. But I... I'm getting so racist in these accents. I apologize to everyone. <laughs> that math doesn't work, sir. That math does not work. And I can't tell what his name is. But it looks like it's too cool for school. I don't think you are. Alright, next one. I don't even have to make a con- I will lit the, uh, oh, I can't. Okay, so, <laughs> me and Chop did 30 songs in three days. 75% ridden, 40% freestyle. The person puts it best, and 115% embarrassing. I cannot beat that. Yeah. These are sad. <laughs> Alright, when you accept that you're accept that you're dead when you're born, you can accept any what? <laughs> I think you use the wrong um <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's perfect. This person's screen name is dope. I'm not gonna show their ads. But their name at this time was Dope. I'm pretty sure you can change these. If not, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dope. I'm sure you're not the only Dope, though. When you accept... I think they're meaning... When you accept that you're dead when you're born, you can accept anything. But they're saying accept. When you accept that you're dead... How can you accept that you're dead? What are you... So... How do you accept something? <laughs> Do you just take it as, oh, I'm alive when I'm born, and so I can believe anything, or I can take the opposite of anything. That word is hard to spell in the next one. You'll see. But the person, the I think it's the editor of this website, 
I'm going to accept that you're probably higher than Giraffe's eyelashes right now. Burn. Alright. Alright, so, this one's making me hungry. It says, just made some cinnamon rolls. But cinnamon spelt completely wrong. I'm going to, once again, I'll be right back. I gotta fix this again. Or I may not be back. I may just sit here. But, um, yeah. Just made some cinnamon rolls. I, um... Wouldn't... Would that make antonym rolls completely bland and boring? Yeah! That's what I have to say to that. Next one! I'm trying to understand this one. OMG, tell me you are a double gang of Tupac. I know who Tupac is. I believe he's dead, isn't he? I don't remember. But, double ganger. The fuck is that? <laughs> well, I like the ex explanation down here. Which, I, you guys can see. So, how do you do this? Don't they kill you if you... Oh, they kill you. They kill you. Ah. <laughs> Body said no. No more racist voice. No more stereotypical black gangster voice. I'm sorry. I don't mean to. Ah, damn it. It doesn't fit. <laughs> I'm going to need a minute. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sorry about that, guys. Oh, that was probably loud. I know I'm loud. And it's my mic is right next to me. If Barco Barner is our president, what is he getting involved with Russia? Scary. I want to ask, who is... Of course, Great Premier Barco Barner is not president of the United States. No, no. He's president of Russia. Premier, even. Totally, that's totally what's going on here. What are you talking about? There is no better companion of America. There's Barack Obama, but, uh, yeah, that's only for a few more years. <laughs> I don't know why I came up with that joke. That was weird. Hey! If you can't have an intellectual conversation with a girl, you aren't talking to her because you don't have intelligence. Intellectual. <laughs> they misspelled intellectual. Which, I'm saying, these, some, some of these words are hard. But even spell check should fix that. I think I need find out how to spell check. My computer has spell check for some reason. I think I need to stop ragging on people. Start making jokes. <laughs> I have all the time I want. Oh! Oh, uh, actually, okay. I think I need to say the rendezvous. Rendezvous. They're trying to say rendezvous. I'm not sure that that's not... I, I couldn't understand that. I had to actually read the comments of the people that you can see. But, um... Uh, yeah. How do I make a joke out of this? Yeah, you need to set up a rendezvous. A rendezvous, as the French calls it. Where you go into back alley. I slid back into Russian because I do not have French accent. But the right Russian guy telling you this. But I heard it. a rendezvous is a wonderful experience. Where a woman rubs your legs until you get stabbed and screwed him by her boyfriend. I believe that's what uh, Ron Dabo is. Da. The da? Da. At the blue, you look like Eminem went down. Sin drum. Sin drum. Sin drum. Um. <laughs> yeah. All that down syndromes. I mean, how else are you? I mean, why would you put a 
the center drum down. You need to put the center drum up so that you can everyone can see it and hear the epic uh, drummer guy. Yeah. Why? Yeah. So wait, when did Eminem get a down center drum? When did Eminem start drum drumming? Did, hmm. Interesting. <laughs> we learned something today. Rip Maya Angelo, you sat on that bus so people today can walk to their dreams. We love you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh. Maya Angelo so sat on that bus. She's like, no, I ain't gonna get up and move to the back. It's only like 10 feet that way, but I'm sitting there. I'm an old lady. Get out of there, loud. I'm going to shit here and chew my eye candy. While Rosa Parks was the one sitting there in the home just going, Yeah, I will write all these stories. They would be magnificent. And, you know, that, that, and Martin Luther King Jr. killed all those kids and Malcolm X sat around at DC talking about equality and his dreams. That's the only what happened. <laughs> I probably screwed something up in that. <laughs> oh, I really need to... I forgot who my angle was. I'm pretty sure it's an art, er, author. Challenge black feminist outlook not making misogynist. Misogynist idea should bring us together, not set us apart. Um, first off, it's massage therapist. There are no misogynists. Because that is a uh, prostitute. As it was explained to me by a massage therapist. I'm not kidding. There are no, apparently, if you you go to a masseuse, you're going to a prostitute, not a not a natural massage person. Apparently, they're called massage therapists. Don't question me. Question the freaking massage therapist that's the president of my fencing club and stabs me all the time. Yeah, that sounded weird. Okay, <sighs> bitch, be losing their. Version tights in middle school trying to judge other people. Version of tight. Version of tit. Version of tights. Version of ties. Version of tights. There we go. Version of tight. Are you trying to say virginities? <laughs> is that what they're trying to say? Oh yeah, those those little girls are little in the version of ties all the time. There's no way to handle them. I need to stop doing all these racist accents. <laughs> I'm not trying to, I wasn't trying to do an Indian. I actually was trying to do a Russian one that time. So, yeah. Losing version of ties. Total problem, bruh. Total. <laughs> uh, I don't even have to read the comments of the people. Happy Labor Day. Be thankful to all the mothers and women to labor for their... Okay. This makes me want to fall over. Be thankful for all the mothers who went into labor for their kids. That's what this holiday is all about. I really want to just keep making jokes. Or trying to. But the stupidity of... <laughs> I don't understand the comment. But... <laughs> I'm gonna have to cut out this spot because I don't. I have to make something up. <laughs> I have nothing for this. I just. Uh. So yeah, Labor Day. Totally. I mean, why else? Uh, what else? Yeah, we want to totally worship all. Or, yeah, worship. That's the word I want. We all, we just worship all the mothers who went to labor. We're just worshiping labor. That's why you don't wear white after Labor Day, guys. You don't wear white because it's all bloody. You can't wear white because when you take that fetus out, or, well, I guess they're not a fetus anymore. When you take the baby out of the womb, out of the... Crap, was it? It goes from the womb to the... Clo... No, that's fallopian tubes higher. Damn it! Fair biology. <laughs> When you take the baby out of the vagina and hold it to you, you get all bloody. Until you put a tap, until you put a little color color in it and give it to the mother and then start screaming its head off and you're like, ah, oh, kill it. <sighs> yeah, that's totally what Labor Day is about. Does salt really attract demands? 
I'm going to pour a salt circle on the floor so I can bring a demand in my house. First, you use salt circles when you summon the demons because they can't get out of the salt circle. And I forgot the reason. But no, that's not what a demand is, sir. A demand is what I'm asking, is what I'm doing to you, to telling you to go back to school. Yeah, go learn your stuff. <laughs> but I want to do all this. Also, you don't pour a salt circle, you arrange a salt circle. And I'm going to go do that right over here and summon a demon. I'll be back! Wait! It didn't work. It didn't work. Get on the next one. <laughs> seven hundred dollar date. Biatch! We can go seventy one hundred dollar dates. You tripping. Math is, yeah, I just sit here throwing all those hundred dollar bills. I only spend seven hundred dollars, like, I spend a hundred dollars every time. I mean, come on, bitch, seven hundred, seventy, day to the hundred, yeah. Wait, I'm out of seven hundred. It's only been the seventh day. What the hell? What's going on, bitch? You spend more of my money than you need to, bitch. <laughs> Math fail, once again. Okay, so there's a show called Fresh Off the Boat in Blackish. But there's no whitish, because it's racist. Wait, there's a show called Fresh Off the Boat in Blackish. Is that one word? Like, is that one title? I actually. Hold on. I'm gonna go look this up. Okay. Fresh off the boat and black is your two different shows. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, we have two broke. What was the name? What two broke girls or whatever? Is, is that our whitish? Does that count? Just, just say that count. Oh, this one has quite a bit. Yo, I want a pizza and can't and when top no toppings or anything. It's your bread. We're excited to hear about this. Please as our friends at Domino's UK at Domino's UK know of this so they can help. E B I I don't know that last word. Never mind. I opened the pizza box upside down. Or open the pizza upside down. <laughs> okay. With the balcon. You know, there's one side that has all the takes and such, all the stuff telling you that there's stuff go there, 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 it tells you a company, all these epic promos and all this colorful new Hey, you just flip it on over and flip it up. Oi! Hey, there's no toppings on this, it's just bread. Why would the blind side just be bread? Just give me bread. I opened it on the right side. It was the blind side. You always open things on the blind side. What well, is the UK? I mean in the UK, yeah, open it bland is your typical normal thing, so obviously you're gonna open it on the blind side because you expect it to just be that. But then, if you're in the UK, you also wouldn't care if you just got bread. 
I mean, as Marie Antoinette once said, let them eat cake, which is right. Someone is going. <laughs> okay, first, no offense to the. I'm just joking here, people. Don't think of them. I'm sorry. Uh. Hey. Hey, ladies! It wouldn't be stalking to you if you acknowledged them. There was sympathy for a woman who ignore women and expect them. <laughs> no men expect them to go away. <laughs> Most stalkers are people who tried and tried over and over to connect and have grown angry because they haven't been acknowledged. No hashtag neutralized. Okay. Stalker. This, can, can, can we get a stalker? Just stick it note on him. Stalker. That's what you eat, stalker. <laughs> Actually, yeah. Why y'all acting like the world just now getting messed up? What about slavery? The Holocaust? Oh my god! <laughs> oh, wow, that one went over my head. Look at my book. Now, if he was being Holocaust, I want to go there. <laughs> I want to go to the Holocaust. I'm going to just go, hmm, yeah, I think that's not properly priced. No, is that. Hmm, yes. Oh, that is totally underpriced. Who? Oh, is that how much that cost back then? I could buy a billion of that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, that appears to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, yeah, I, uh, I want to face plant so much. Oh my gosh. I know you guys can still see what I'm doing. I, I'm just minting at the just pure stupidity of what's going on. What did I do? I wanted to add a green region. Uh, there we go. Alright. <laughs> so, that's it for this video. I will get to editing that. Not now. Damn it. Now, where's my phone? I gotta check my email. <laughs> I have work soon, so. I will see you guys in the next video. Or, wait. Almost forgot some. Almost the match over that thing. These are links to the next possible choices of the dumbest tweet. Reading dumbest tweets dot com. Vote in the comments, and I will see you guys in another video. Das Vidania.